Welcome Bafi to, to the Benta. My name is Mohau Kwebu, reporting live from Johannesburg. So today I just want us to talk about the episode Ya Shoma Josie, the time I let go Dales podcast. People are disgusted. People are feeling that Shoma Josie has went there and tarnished her own brand. And why did she do that? And why now? And I watched the podcast, I enjoyed everything that came through. I could read that there was friendship between the two people that were, you know, what we're talking there. But also, I could also tell that there is history that is so much deeper that maybe it didn't come out of the, of, of the podcast. But what is so crucial right now is that we are now at a point where every artist is realizing that podcast is the platform for them to go and promote and elevate their brands but now is this working and helping them right feeling a bone and the episode my sister's relax lapana but towards the ending as born is getting that says humble about my life and enye ibuzo kuthi you have done so much you have achieved things that nobody in your category has done at your age why is it that you are able to consciously so be able to put your brand especially when you are going to be promoting a children and kids book which i absolutely love i felt this is one of the things big artists suffer mostly I suspect there is some change probably in the management. I suspect probably because I heard also that she has taken time to relax and you know and you know. So I realized that with that the attitude towards music and how she 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 she, she is being perceived by that single podcast the entire thing has changed. I love Shoma Josie. I think Shoma Jose is the best thing that has ever happened to South Africa right now. And even on the past five years. Remember Hoku. Remember John Cena. Remember her on that is a Isi Tembu, that soapy that she was shooting. I loved her, even if she believes that she was acting terribly there. I, I loved her from there. And people who know me would tell you that I called it first that Shoma Jose is the best. But this is one of your mistakes, sister. And we need to make sure good say cover up. And it sends a show to reach out to the people. You know, in this week, I'm expecting to see a statement coming from you to say, Buffet to me as Shoma Josie, who have created a child brand, a child friendly brand, has went on a platform, went there, got myself drunk, and in the, in the process, tarnished the very same brand that is making me who I am today. Who is Shoma Josie without the colors that she has? Who is Shoma Josie without the kids that are dancing around her? So I think in this one, with love, with respect, is in Dwazambanga grand. And then I felt for to go to a podcast, there some, should be sometimes like a presser, a pause in my mind. Because I feel sometimes we let the record thing to continue to happen so that we can continue to have conversations like this and chat. If I come to your podcast, I want to elevate you and bring my fans to you. But if I come there and there's something wrong and you don't see the difference, we're going to have a problem with that. And you don't call me out or you don't pause and say, no, let's take a break. But also I realized with Shoma Josie, he had people that she was traveling with there. And those people said nothing, nothing at all, up until that show ended. And it was painful to watch it towards the end as she was slurring and could not even, you know. But either way, I'm showing love. I'm saying I'm my sister. Um, I still feel good, you still have power, just reach out to your people, apologize, and then you don't to pay, and then so that we can move on, you know. So um, this is Mohau, another banter on podcast things that I've seen. You've realized that now on my channel right now, I've started to, you know, catalog all the conversations that I have. You're going to have conversations about court cases, banter where we're talking Senzo Meiwa and anything that is trending in terms of courts. You're going to have co-parenting banter, where as a single parent, we're going to have conversation and share on how, you know, this thing is happening, how it's working, you know, you know according to my way. And then you're going to have 
um, speed bribe banter, anything that just come into my mind. But for now, thank you so much for tuning in. If you have been with me up until this far, press that like, press that subscribe. It's been so Thank you so much. Press record. Stop.